Hello, I'm back with a new video. It's Christmas and of course Christmas is the perfect holiday for happiness and sweet sounding music and thinking about how to care about each other. But, be but because I'm not a big fan of Christmas, I'm going to review Itze by the Finnish black metal band Ayatara. For those of you who are not familiar with Ayatara, Ayatara is a Finnish black metal band started in 1996 and well their sound can best be described as a mix of symphonic black metal and doom metal. Unfortunately though the band has been the band has stopped. Uh, the band what the band was disbanded in 2012 unfortunately because this album is awesome. There's a little story about how I got this CD. As I've said before my dad owns a secondhand store and there was a guy who and there was a guy who wanted to do who wanted to donate his CD collection or at least his metal section to the store and my father and my father told him like well and my father started talking with him and well that guy all of, all of a sudden all of a sudden he decided to donate his entire or at least a small section of his metal collection to me and well most of the bands most of the bands which were in that collection were unknown to me yeah and this CD was in there and I was just looking at the I was just looking at the, at the covers, you know, like well, I want to listen to something dark, and I don't know, yeah, I was I wanted to listen to something dark, misanthropic, mm -hmm. full of me, full of emptiness. And then I and then I saw the cover of Itze, and I just thought to myself, like, well, I need to listen to this. As I said before, this album is a mix of black metal and doom metal. Although the doom metal part of this album isn't doom metal like My Dying Bride. The doom metal aspect on this album is that although the songs are still relatively slow, the, this album really has a mid-tempo. The thing is just that for some reason, if you for some reason, because the guitars are just unbelievably heavy. The music sounds faster than it really is. Also, a thing which I really like about this album are the keyboard tunes. The keyboard tunes of this album really give this album something, something dark and I don't know, misant misanthropic. Yeah, basic. This album is just, this album is just misanthropy presented on a disc. It is just the atmosphere on this album is unbelievable. The vocalist is also awesome. If I'm not mistaken. This band has the same vocalist as Amorphis, although I haven't really checked Amorphis out yet. I really like this type of vocals. Although the vocalist still does, you know, the typical black metal screeching and screaming. I don't know, there, because the music is so incredibly heavy and because the production is so good, you know, instead of, uh, instead of, um, instead of other black metal bands, you know, like Burzum and Dark Throne and Golgoroth. On which, on which sometimes the production is a little bit questionable because the production is so good also another th also another thing what I really like is that sometimes the band tries to diversify a little you know with clean vocals which in my opinion only add to the atmosphere everything on this album adds to the atmosphere <laughs> But there is one big downside to this album, and that is, for some reason, it just does. For some reason, it just isn't reaching the sweet spot. Although the atmosphere is great, although the music is great, the album is seriously lacking in diversity. Overall, 
The guitars are awesome. They are very heavy and really contribute to the atmosphere. The speed is awesome. Yeah, it is faster than doom metal, but it is still somewhat slow. The vocalist is awesome. The keyboards are awesome. The atmosphere is awesome. As I said, it is just misanthropy presented, you, presented to you on a disc. This album is seriously lacking in diversity. If I would recommend this album, I will, I will probably say like, well, if you like this specific kind of metal, then this album definitely is something for you. But if you're, but if you're in, but if you need more diversity, then this album isn't exactly an album for you. Or perhaps, or you could do what I did, just listen to the album in small bits. So I hope you liked the review, and bye.